What up? What it do? It's your boy JDQ, and as always on this channel, it's one video a day, nothing gets in the way. And as always, peep the hat, shining, shining like a diamond. All right, gold right in your face with my name on it and the shirt. All right, so I've shown you guys. Um, oh, I forgot I did trim the beard and get a haircut. All right, so I forgot to, you know, expand on that. But yes, as you can clearly see, maybe I. Well, not me. Maybe the barber went a little too far, but I'm not mad. It just gives me more of a reason to grow it back out and longer. So it is what it is. Anyways, so about some time ago, I want to say like a month ago or maybe a little bit more, um, I have I have bought this uh, drawing pad. But if I can just kind of. So I bought this a while back ago, okay? Because I have a secret project in the works. But as you can see, this is the first page and I have not used it yet, all right? Also, to go along with that pad, I bought these pens, all right? These are fine line markers. Um, when I bought the pad at the same time, I asked um, one of the workers, I think it was at Michael's or Hobby Lobby, or one of those places, um, which marker was best for that drawing pad. Because I was, you know, looking to do like actual comic book artwork. And he recommended those. So I trust him. And I did do a little research before buying them and all this other stuff. And, you know, apparently it is a good fit. It's a good match. And um, so I got them. And as you can see, and as, as I just said, I have not either used any of these markers or the pad itself, right? Um, one of the reasons is because of what I, I just said a minute ago, I have a project in mind that I want to do and I want it to come out nice or whatever. And that's why I got that paper because I want to give the best of the best for what I'm trying to do. Um, so at the same time though, it's also the reason why I haven't used it yet. <laughs> um, you might be asking to yourself, like, I don't get it. Well, me, um, I don't believe or think that I'm at the level yet to even use this paper because of how fragile and delicate it is. Um, I was explaining to my girlfriend how it's one of those papers where if you make a mistake and you have to like erase or kind of like fix something, It'll leave marks and make it a little bit more difficult to, you know, uh, make the artwork look clean. So in my mind, you have to be ready to like use this kind of paper, like know what you're doing. So, but um, uh, thanks to her advice, because she she believes in me um, more than I believe in myself. So I, I thank her for that. And so, because of her and other people um, in my uh, circle, I uh, feel the same way. They believe in me more than I believe myself. And they're pushing me to um, pretty much step out of my box and comfort zone and try the new things and expand my horizons. Not to sound cliche, but you know. Um, I decided to, you know what? Like, aside from the project, I'm going to give this paper and these markers a try. Right? And um, I want to make you guys um, part of this whole journey of like me using this for the first time. All right. So in the comment section below. All right. Think of any character um, that you would like to see on that paper. All right. Mind you, if you go look this type of like paper online and look at examples of how it's supposed to look that'll give you more of an idea of like what's the big deal of this paper and you know what's the big deal of how the artwork is going to look on the paper etc etc so you know if you haven't looked or seen any of it yet i suggest to just do a little research and put um comic book art on bristol paper or something like that so you get an idea all right 
And so, yeah, so just kind of like think of any character that you would like to, to see me do on one of those papers. And, um, yeah, hopefully uh, if I get down to, um, hopefully it doesn't get to a voting process, but hopefully y'all decide on like one similar character or something like along the lines of one type of character or whatever, something simple, all right? Don't be saying nothing like Gundam robots or I don't know Iron Man suits that's way that's way beyond my skill level all right so just kind of like keep that in mind while you're choosing and um yeah just write in the, sec in the comment section below um who or what you'd like to see me draw on this new paper all right anyways guys I just wanted to bring that up real quick and hopefully it makes for a good play this because if, if it goes well on the first video of whatever you guys decide for me to do i'll keep making more videos of me using this paper and these markers all right thank you for the view thank you for the thumbs up thank you for subscribing to the channel thank you for sharing the video with everybody else who's into uh art drawing sketching coloring comics all that good stuff love you all and peace out